right, so we're all loaded up and ready to go. Just waiting on Alex to get over here and we're out. Woo! So it is a new day. Take two. All right, so today, today's video is gonna be over the course of the next couple of days, okay? We're gonna do a couple dive videos. I'm off for a couple days. Figure let's have some fun finally. We got some beautiful weather. Look at that. How freaking nice, man. Blue skies. The wind is like non-existent pretty much. It's looking like it's gonna be a good day out there. Dude, looking beautiful. Yesterday was beautiful. Yesterday was great. Yeah, we went out yesterday with Dixie Divers who we're going out with again today. Uh, it's a store down the street from my house that I've been going to for years and years. Great people. Go look them up. Go add them on Instagram. Give them some follows and check out their products. Badass store. They sell a bunch of stuff online. They also have a boat of their own and do scuba dive charters, which is really cool. So yesterday, we started making a video for them, and uh, it was crazy. We had a great dive. It was the first time we were be able to be out in the, in the last couple weeks. Lost the GoPro. Yep. Brand new GoPro 9 sank to the bottom of the ocean. Yeah, all right. Sucks. We had a couple couple instances. We forgot the dive flag at one spot that we stopped <laughs> at, Alex. And then uh, he passed the GoPro to me. I was getting, we were shooting lionfish, saw really big nurse sharks, saw a bunch of cool stuff, and then lost it. So, today's take two. But it's going to be fun. Yeah, I'm ready to go. We're li we're late. They just called me. It's 8:15 right now. The boat leaves at 8:30. So thank God it's really close to my house because we're jetting over there real quick. <laughs> we are here, bro. Uh, we're waiting at the bridge right now. And everybody's ready, geared up. It's gonna be awesome. So today we're doing a couple smaller dives. I set you guys up on flag seven. Thanks. No problem. Appreciate you. So we're gonna try to catch some lobster, maybe spear some lionfish, not lose the GoPro, and have a fun day, not lose the flag. Gotta keep the flag the whole time today. All right, let's get out there.
Alright guys, so that is it. Dude, we had a great day, right? These are the days you look for. It really is. We it killed it. We, we needed today. Today so, was a huge morale boost. Yeah, for real. Today was a much needed day. Especially having all this crappy weather for the last couple weeks. Really brings the energy down. This was just like a nice this is awesome. charger. It's great. Two days in a row diving? Dude, can't beat that. Can't beat it. We're back over here at Dixie Divers. We're going to fill up a couple more tanks because who knows when the next time we'll be able to go out. The weather is already starting to turn. Maybe tomorrow is going to be good. Maybe it's not. But regardless, we're stopping, filling our tanks. Dude, make sure you guys check out Dixie Divers, okay? Do me a huge favor. Go on their Instagram. Give them a follow. Go follow them on YouTube also. They have a YouTube channel. It's very old. But we're going to get to refreshing all those videos. We're going to make some dope content for them. So go hit them up on social media. Let them know you guys came from us, all right? And stay tuned for more awesomeness to come because it's just the beginning. It's the end of the year. The weather's kind of getting a little crappy, but next year, bro, it's game on, man. If you guys like these diving videos, just make sure you stay tuned. We're gonna be doing way more cool stuff in the future, traveling all over the place. I'm trying to go to Australia next year, I'm trying to go to South Africa. Dude, we're going to some Guadalupe for sure. You were supposed to go earlier this year. I was supposed to be in Guadalupe, basically be getting back right now. Ah, great white shark diving. Like, dude, stay tuned. It's gonna be badass. Make sure you're subscribed to the channel. Thank you guys for watching. Hit us up in the comments down below. Let us know more stuff you want us to see, maybe more places you want us to dive. Give us ideas, all right? Do you know some cool dives in Florida that we can get to? Yeah. Tell us. And if you guys dive, yo, hit us up. Let's get Seriously. some Let's get some group stuff going on. We're, we're trying to get out there and do more things, all right? So until next time, guys, you are the best. Make sure follow Dixie Divers, and I'll see you next time. So, time to cook them. 
So what we're gonna do first is we're gonna cut all these spines off of them. Cause this is a venomous fish, keep in mind. I actually, underneath my glove, earlier today when I was putting them in the Ziploc to put them in the fridge, I stabbed myself with one and got snow. Awesome. Wasn't that bad though. It's not a too bad of a sting. Everybody has different reactions. It's not the first time I've been stung. It wasn't too bad. But anyways, dorsal fins, pectoral fins, and the anal fin. Look, see that little barb right there? Boom. That's one of the barbs right there. So what I'm going to do first before I fillet these things is I'm going to cut all the barbs off just to make sure there's no accidents. And then I'll prick myself again when we're filleting them. how little these fillets are. Dude, this is not easy. I'm using a tiny little fillet knife. These are tiny little fillets. Check that out. Nice white meat. It's gonna be delicious, I'm pretty stoked. Now there's no scales on line fish, I don't know if you guys knew that, but no scales on these fish, they're smooth, so you don't have to descale anything. We're just gonna cook it up just like that. So let's keep on. Keep on getting these uh, fillets off there. All right, check this out. Super nice white fillets. Looks pretty dang good, man. Lobster and lionfish for dinner. 